Hi, I'm Jen, and welcome to Jen O All Trades. This week, I'm going to give you some of my catering secrets and the five secret ingredients to all Italian pasta that makes it taste exactly like my grandma Della Rosa used to make. The first key ingredient is, of course, tomatoes. But what kind of tomato? Roma tomatoes. Those are the oblong kind that you see in the store, not the round beef steaky kind. If you use those, it'll, it'll taste terrible. Also, extra virgin olive oil. The Italian variety is best. It's got the best crispest flavor. The third, fourth, and fifth key ingredients are all spices. Oregano, basil, and garlic. Now, the basil and the oregano, they're okay in the dried form, though fresh is always best, of course. But the garlic, you definitely want to do your garlic fresh. And invest in this. This is called a garlic press. It gets the most flavor out of your garlic. And if you like really garlicky pastas, Add it in towards the end. If you don't like the garlic taste so much, add your garlic in towards the beginning. The more garlic cooks, the less flavor you can taste in the end. When you're cooking pasta, I always like to look on the back of the package and subtract two minutes off of the cooking time that it says. That makes it el dante. That's what restaurants are famous for when they serve it so it's not too mushy, it's to the teeth. It's el dante. If you wanna know when that piece is ready or your whole pot is ready, just take a little strand out, throw it up against the wall. If it sticks to the wall, it's ready. I know that sounds crazy, but you'll see a lot of Italian grandmas doing that same crazy trick. So join me next week in Gen O All Trades when I tell you how you can detox through the pores of your feet in just 30 minutes. Join me next week.